Hello good YouTube people, it's Captain Lope coming in with you. Kind of a different time of day to be coming in. I know it's uh, it's light out, you can actually see what I'm filming. But things were a little weird today. I got called to a fire at 11.30 last night. Two campers burned up and it was suspicious. Apparently uh, someone was seen leaving the area on a bicycle with a gasoline can. So something odd going on there. So when I got home at 2 in the morning I just uh, so I'd do my dive then. Then when I got back from my dive, got ready to film, um, had everything set up, the camera was dead. So I charged up the camera and uh, fell asleep on the couch for a while. And then my stuff got rained on. I got some Keurig parts in here today. And I got all these, uh, all these K-cups and green tea. Stuff that I previously dove up before, but I'm gonna take those over to my neighbor, Ed. My wife and I were just over there visiting him and his lady and his hyper little Pomeranian puppy named Max. Oh, that thing's a monster. They call it a Tasmanian devil. Spins around and bites you. But anyhow, I got a uh, knife sharpener here. And I haven't tried this one out. It's a battery powered knife sharpener. Press button. But uh, it probably works. I'll put batteries in it and try it out and see what happens. And I got some flashlights. And the cutest little kitty kitty greeting card there. It's one of those pop up ones. And also got a uh, turkey baster that had a return slip on it, said it was broken, but I don't see anything wrong with it. Got this uh, photo book. Apparently, you can make your own custom books. And uh, someone must have made one with their kitties and their horses in it. Must not have turned out good enough for them. Got one of those roto clippers that you see on TV. So you know it's got to be good. Put batteries in that and I'll try it out. Don't know what's up with that yet. The other morning I went to this clothing store that I go to that usually tears everything up and they, they tore most everything up. You know they tore the tags off of some stuff. But that one fuzzy vest in there, a really, really soft one, seems to be perfectly good. And this little red fuzzy jacket only has a couple little holes in it that might be able to be fixed. The nicest thing in there though was this this pair of boots. Densolite boots. And these are just a little too big for my wife unfortunately. But they look brand new. I don't know, they may have been used very slightly, but they look to be in great shape. And the other morning on my way home from work, I stopped at one of my regular stops and there was eight jars of sweet red pepper strips in there. Looks like they got garlic in them too, so that's awesome. Love my garlic. The sweet spot has not really been that sweet lately. But it seems to be getting sweeter. They had this stool in here today and it's got this, uh, this one support broken on here, so I don't know what I'll do with that, you know, maybe try and glue it, it'll, it'll never be as strong as it should be. But, you know, if you sit on it carefully, you're probably not going to fall, it's probably not going to break or anything. They threw out uh, a bathroom rug, put red paint on it, of course, because that's what they like to do at the sweet spot. At least they threw good stuff away. I think they were, like, not throwing away their desirable items. But, uh, you know, I've gotten one of these once before. And this, the one that I got before, I believe was brand new. And this one here, used and returned. But it's a, a foot massager and a calf massager. And it works. And what I'm thinking is maybe I'll just uh, keep this one for my own use and then maybe sell the other one in a garage sale. But it's got some different settings on it. You can put it in relax and refresh mode. And squeezes your calves and your feet. And I use the one that I have every once in a while. I never did film that one. For some reason I just never got around to that. I was always going to do it, but always forgetting. And then there was also a uh, Mr. Coffee in there today. And return slip on that says that it doesn't turn on. So, I don't know. We'll try it out. Maybe maybe so, maybe not. And then, uh, oh, another one of these uh, coffee makers. I uh, can't 
CBTL is this one and I don't know what's up with that I don't think I have the right pods for it then I also got a bunch of these uh, little frozen ice pack deals here which are nice actually could have got more of those too but these are nice they're nice and flat so they'll fit in your cooler without taking up a whole lot of space so I was happy to get those but anyhow that's uh, Captain Lopes uh, little score for today and well, a couple little things a few days ago so anyhow I'm gonna run this uh, Snapple peach iced tea and this green tea and these decaf K-Cups over to my neighbors. Let y'all have a great day. Carpe Garbage.